Hi everybody, it's Miss B here. Um, today is Tuesday and we are going to be talking about a insect and its life cycle. So before I tell you what it is, I want you to think and guess what you think we're going to be talking about today. This insect has two wings and they look the same on both sides. This insect also has two antennas and he comes out and flies around in the spring. Hmm, I want you to think, what do you think we're gonna be talking about today? Did you guess a butterfly? Yes, that is exactly what we're gonna be talking about. We're gonna talk all about the butterfly life cycle. Before we read and get into details about all the stages of the butterfly, I wanted to quickly go over it with you before we have the beginning of the life cycle. What does that look like to you? These are the eggs. This is the first stage. Then the egg hatches and then what comes out? A caterpillar. After that caterpillar munches on some leaves and eats and grows, he starts to change into a chrysalis or a pupa. This thing that's hanging off the branch. And then out of the chrysalis becomes a beautiful butterfly. So those are the four stages of the butterfly. Now what we're gonna do is we are going to read a story about the stages of the butterfly and we're gonna go into detail. All right, let's begin. Butterflies are beautiful insects. Look at all these beautiful butterflies. And if you notice something here, if you look at their wings, they're the exact same on each side because they're symmetrical. I know that's a big word. They show symmetry. This the same on this side. It's pretty cool. fly from flower to flower, drinking nectar from their long tongues. I'm going to show you up close. Here's a picture of the butterfly drinking from the flower with their tongue, getting all that yummy nectar. Look at all those beautiful butterflies flying around. But a butterfly doesn't always look this way. A butterfly begins life as a tiny egg. Here it is in the picture. Now this might look big to you, but they're actually very, very, very tiny. Very hard to see. They're on a leaf. The egg hatches in a few days. If you look, you see something coming out of the egg. Let's see what it is. Out comes a caterpillar. There he is. Another word for a baby caterpillar is called a larva. The young caterpillar is very hungry. It eats its eggshell. He needs to eat lots of food to grow. He is very little and he's hungry. So he eats his shell. Then it starts to eat leaves. It eats many, many leaves. Do you notice how big he got? He's starting to eat a lot. He's already looking different. The caterpillar eats and grows, eats and grows. Look how big this caterpillar has grown. Oh my goodness. Look at, that's how tiny he used to be and then he kept eating all those leaves and now he's, he's big. Look at him. All right. Now the caterpillar is ready to change. It hangs from a branch. He finds a branch and then he hangs himself. He curls up. He's getting ready to change. Slowly, the caterpillar turns into a pupa. 
Another word for pupa is called a chrysalis or a cocoon. Here he is, he's starting to change. It forms a hard shell. There it is. Let's see. From outside, the pupa looks very still, but inside, much is going on. Can you see what is happening to the pupa? What do you notice from this picture to this picture? What has changed? Hmm. Let's see. After some time, out comes a butterfly. He's starting to come out of his chrysalis. The butterfly's wings are wet and crumpled. See his wings? You see how bent and crumpled they are? Because they were all tight in there. So now that he's out, he has to let his wings hang and dry and fill out before he can fly. Now the butterfly's wings are strong. The butterfly can fly. Look at how big he got when he was, this thing was so tiny. Now he's so big, his wings are out. Where do you think this butterfly is going? Hmm, maybe it's going to your backyard. I wonder where he's going. All right, so that is a butterfly is born, all about the life cycle of a butterfly. So now, after you're done watching that, you guys are gonna have the activity to do and you're gonna make your own butterfly life cycle. So just like I talked about in the book, the first step is right here, the egg. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna cut out all these pictures and see which, put them in the right order, see which one they go in. All right, so that's what you're gonna be doing after the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm um, talking about butterfly life cycles and I can't wait to see you guys soon. Bye.